Pass or fail, thumbs up or thumbs down for a pass or fail. I got a lot of thumbs up. And you know what? Even though some of you may have some points, it's not too bad. I will tell you this. some really, really quick hits when, as an inspector, you walk onto a job and you see um, the concrete all cut raggedly and piles of concrete over here not removed from the job site. That raises red flags. But that's kind of, you know, it could have been the general contractor piece. What question would I ask a plumber? I'd be going, is that shit going to be out of here before we backfill with more sand over here? If they go, well, I don't know, then, um, yeah, we're going to have a talk. We're going to communicate about get that shit out of here, and then I'll come back. Either that or have me come back when that's backfilled because I want to make sure it gets backfilled, and I don't want to see any of that stuff in the trenching. So there's some good stuff here that the plumber did. The plumber sleeved the piping. Really, really not. Um, it's a good attempt at sleeving. But just the fact that the plumber did it is really, really awesome. But one wrap around with what we call this um, sill seal that really is for under a sill for the plate that goes on the top of foundation wall, um, not really good. But when you're bringing a PVC pipe through a, through a concrete floor, a concrete wall, what is the space that should be around the pipe? How many inches? It should be one inch sleeve protecting that pipe as it comes. Because remember, Schedule 40 PVC expands, and this is Schedule 40 PVC you're looking at. Three-eighths of an inch every 10 feet with a 100-degree temperature change. That's a huge, that's a violent expansion contraction rate, if you didn't know. And in some cases, it'll snap pipe off right at the floor. So if you're working with people who aren't doing it, friendly reminder, that all your piping should be sleeved when it's Schedule 40 coming up through a floor. Kind of going to like have somewhere for the expansion and contraction to go. So there was a lot of good things here. I could have been a prick a little bit, but I wasn't. That was a pass. Most of you would have passed it. 